we have to divide and reduce to the lowest terms. We have here parentheses. So let me remind you of the order of operations. First, we have to do whatever we have in parentheses. So the first algebraic fraction we will copy. So this is 18t squared plus 90 minus 20 over 6t squared minus 5t minus 4. We copy division sign and in parentheses we have division of algebraic fractions. We know that when we divide algebraic fractions, we have to use the same rule like for division of fractions. So we have to copy first algebraic fraction. So this is 2t squared minus 9t minus 5 over 9t squared minus 16. And we have to change division sign to multiplication. We have to flip the second algebraic fraction. So it will be 12t squared minus 10t over 4t squared plus 4t plus 1. Close brackets. So now in parentheses when we multiply two algebraic fractions we have to multiply numerator times numerator, denominator times denominator. So this is equal first algebraic fraction we need to copy. So this is 18t squared plus 9t minus 20 over 6t squared minus 5t minus 4. And we have division sign. And in brackets, now when we do multiplication, I don't have to put these brackets. We will have fraction, one fraction bar. And numerator times numerator, so it will be 2t squared minus 9t minus 5 times 12t squared minus 10t over 9t squared minus 16 times 4t squared plus 4t plus 1. So this is equal now. We have division of algebraic fractions, two algebraic fractions. So we need to copy first algebraic fraction 18t squared plus 9t minus 20 over 6t squared minus 5t minus 4. We have to change division sign to multiplication and we have to flip the second algebraic fraction. So numerator we go to denominator and denominator to numerator. So we'll have 9t squared minus 16 times 4t squared plus 4t plus 1 over 2t squared minus 9t minus 5 times 12t squared minus 10t. Now we have to multiply again numerator times numerator, denominator times denominator. What else we can do? We need to factorize. So, because we need to reduce to the lowest terms and we don't see an expression in parentheses that repeat. So, let's start from the first trinomial. We have 18t squared plus 9t minus 20. We will try to use grouping method. Let me copy this expression. We have 18t squared plus 9t minus 20. So first I have to multiply 18 times negative 20. We multiply coefficient before t squared by the constant. So this is equal negative 360. We have to find two numbers which I multiply and I will have negative 360. And when I add them, I need to have coefficient before t is 9. So it will be 24 and negative 15. So now we can rewrite our trinomial. 18t squared we can copy and 90 we will rewrite that this is 24 24 of course t minus 15t 
and we have to copy negative 20. We still have the same expression in side because 20 for t minus 15 t is 9 t. Now we can factorize from this two first parentheses we can factorize 6 t so it will be 3 t minus 4 and from the last two expressions will be negative 5 and in parentheses will be 3 t minus 4 of course plus and of course I have positive 24 so here I should have plus 4 so this is equal I can factorize 3 t plus 4 so in the second parenthesis I will have 6 t minus 5 so I can rewrite first trinomial to this expression we have 3 t plus 4 times 6t minus 5 times I will put now one fraction bar and we have 9t square minus 16 I can rewrite that this is 3t to second power minus 4 to second power so we have a difference of two perfect squares. Let me remind you for me one. When we have a square minus b square, this is equal a minus b times a plus b. So the second parenthesis we can rewrite that this is 3t minus 4 times 3t plus 4. And the last we if we rewrite that 4t is 2t to second power so and 1 this is like 1 to second power so we see that we have here square of sum so we can rewrite that this is 2t plus 1 let's check I just use form 1 that a plus b to second power this is a square plus 2 a b plus b square so let's check 2 t to second power so will be 4 t square we have next we have 2 a b so 2 times 2 t will be 4 t times 1 is 4 t and 1 to second power is 1 so everything is correct and now we have to do factorization for our denominator so let me copy first expression in the denominator we have 6t square minus 5t minus 4 because we have again general quadratic trinomial here so first we will try to use grouping method and First we multiply coefficient before t squared by the constant so 6 times negative 4 is equal negative 24 so I need to find two numbers which I multiply and I will have negative 24 and when I add them I need to have coefficient before t is negative 5 so it will be negative 8 and 3 of course so now I can rewrite our trinomial that is a 6t square I have to copy and negative 5t I will rewrite that this is negative 8t plus 3t minus 4 we have to copy now next I will factorize from these two first expressions 2t so in parentheses we will have 3t minus 4 And from this last two, I can factorize one only, so it will be 3t minus 4. So this is equal 3t minus 4, we can factorize. And in the second parenthesis, we have whatever left, so we will have whatever left, so 2t plus 1. So now I can rewrite first 
expression in my denominator that this is 3t minus 4 times 2t plus 1. Next, we have 2t squared minus 9t minus 5. So let's check if we can factorize this by using gr grouping method. So let me copy. We have 2t squared minus 9t minus 5. So coefficient before t is different than 1, so I have to multiply 2 times constant, so negative 5, so this is equal to negative 10. Next, I have to find two numbers which I multiply and I will have negative 10. And when I add them, I will have coefficient before t, this is negative 9. So this, it will be 1 and negative 10. So now I can rewrite our trinomial. 2t square we have to copy. And I will have negative 19, that this is negative 10 t plus 1 t. And we have a minus 5 we have to copy. So this is equal. We can factorize 2 t from this first two expressions. So we will have t minus 5 in parentheses. And from the last two, we can factorize only one. So it will be t minus 5. So this is equal. t minus 5 we will factorize. And in parentheses, we will have 2t plus 1. So now I can rewrite the second expression in parentheses in the denominator. That this is t minus 5 times 2t plus 1. And from the last parenthesis I can factorize 2t. So it will be 6t minus 5. So now we have to check if we can reduce. Because we have multiplication so we now have to check expression in parentheses. 3t plus 4 we don't have in the denominator. 6t minus 5 we have so we can cancel out. 3t minus 4 and 3t minus 4 yes. 3t plus 4 we don't have and 2t plus 1 we have 2t plus 1 times 2t plus 1 so this is 2t plus 1 to second power so we can reduce and now we have in the numerator 3t plus 4 times 3t plus 4 so this is 3t plus 4 to second power over we have t minus 5 times 2t, so 2t I will put first times t minus 5. This is my solution.